And that's why I said no, no, no. I can't eat another one. I will just explode. Okay, so today, today's topic, all right, the how not to suck at teaching for today is going to be based on consistency. All right, so for consistency, how are you consistent as a teacher in your classroom? How are you consistent in the lessons that you're preparing, the way that you approach your students, the way that you talk to your students, how are you consistent? Uh, so the big takeaway from today's video is going to be how, are, how is your, what is the consistency that you provide as an instructor? It's cool, boss. Um, so that's, so that's the big topic that I want, that I wanted to just, you know, touch on today. Uh, for me, every day is Groundhog Day and I'm very adamant in keeping that. Why are my glasses? I don't know. Okay. Okay, so t so uh, so Groundhog Day. Every th every day is Groundhog Day in my classroom. I start my day off with the exact same regiment that I do every single day. Morning class is what we're doing today. Hey class is what we're doing today. Whatever, what you know, because time of day that does change. Um, and right after that, this is what I need done. This is what we got to do, and show them the how to, what we have to take care of. Then we do the work time where we're working through whatever the projects that we're working on, and then we quickly close where everybody's cleaning up. All right, so everybody got this done today. Everybody was accomplished this. Next class, we're going to work on this. So then reaffirming with what we learned today and then moving into the, hey, this is what we're doing tomorrow, so that there is a clear progression of cause and effect of what you're doing in instruction so that kids know, hey, we're doing this for a purpose. Uh, but then it's consistent that every single day they come in, um, that is how I approach the class. That is how. That is exactly the phrasing I say to the class. And the consistency is key for a lot of reasons. Number one, it provides uh, a comfort level to many students because the students will never tell you that they want consistency. They want security. They they want to not have to worry. They're never going to say that. However, that is what they need. And. Uh, it makes their life so much easier. As soon as they see that you are absolutely 100% consistent in the way that you do, 90% of the issues that you have go out the window. Uh, now, coming up with a consistency, that's a different story altogether because not everybody understands what consistency is, how to achieve consistency, and it, it's, it is trial by fire. So come up with a game plan, write something out like me. I have like 15 notebooks that I'm, I'm taking notes on all the time. Um, come up with a consistent plan so that you have a clear directive approach to the way that you teach, the way that you engage with your students so that you can provide that quality instruction along with a uh, security in the way that your classroom runs. And that, that just makes your life easier. It makes you not suck as a teacher. All right, you guys, I will see you on the next one. Oh no, I hit a traffic jam. Try not to die. Woo! All right, so I will see you guys next, next class. Later.